Hi, I'm Mike Hopkins from Imagination Technologies. Uh, so I'm here at CES 2012 and I just wanted to uh, explain to you about some of our communications technology that we have available. So we're essentially an IP company and we license the technology to semiconductor manufacturers who then develop products from that. Now the development that we have here is a development board which is using our Insigma technology which is a radio processor unit that is capable of demodulating various sort of worldwide broadcast standards as well as communication standards such as Wi-Fi or even Bluetooth. So what we have on this demonstration is a system where we have a, D a modulator which is producing a DVB-T signal and we're actually feeding that signal into a tuner which is through here and that gets demodulated in a chip on the board. What we do is we then send the signal back to the PC where it gets decoded in real time and that forms one channel. At the same time, simultaneously, we have a Wi-Fi link where we're actually sending this video clip over Wi-Fi through a Wi-Fi tuner and it's demodulated on the same chip. We then incorporate our metaprocessor core, which is also on the chip, to decode that signal and it's shown over here. So what you have is the ability to sort of simultaneously use sort of broadcast and communication standards on a single chip, on a single core of that chip. And you can actually support all of the various worldwide standards. So if you're looking to produce a broadcast device or a radio device or a TV device, you can use the demodulator technology for that functionality. You can then sort of add in Wi-Fi connectivity to that and produce something like a smart TV as an example. But essentially what we have on the board there is a connected processor device. So it doesn't just go forward in terms of sort of broadcast and, uh, and, and, and consumer electronics devices. You can also add that to modules and then start to build up uh, a device where you have connected processors running in machine-to-machine -machine communications. So it's a fully flexible system that allows you the ability to build up many different applications using the same core technology. And again, it covers worldwide standards, so you're not restricted to having one modulator for one particular country. You can actually have the flexibility with a single platform to support all of the worldwide standards.